It's Howie Roseman's world, and we're just living in it as what a what a draft for the Eagles, getting Jalen Carter with pick number nine. And then Nolan Smith fell a little bit, uh, which was a surprise. Uh, he was someone who a lot of people thought would go higher in this draft class. Uh, he was 16th on the consensus big board. He ends up falling all the way to 30, where the Eagles happily select him. The Eagles, a couple of great prospects at the defensive line position they got someone who uh, you know I, I had as one of my favorite uh, edge rushers in Nolan Smith I think that he was I actually had him as my number two edge rusher and I had Carter as my number one overall player that is not quarterback so the fact that they got both of these guys is absurd like that should not have happened that they were able to pull that off and it's definitely something that you got to feel pretty happy about if you're an Eagles fan now again I think the one thing you could argue is, is this the biggest position of need for Philadelphia? They already had a pretty good defensive line. Is that where you want to go with? I think they were more focused on just getting the best players available. You know, uh, you know, the Eagles are an analytically inclined team for sure. They pay attention to that stuff. And analytics say just draft best player available. So they have Josh Sweat. They have Hassan Reddick. They have Brandon Graham. Well, now they have Nolan Smith, and listen, he'll get some snaps. He'll get some playing time. He could even get – see, I, I wouldn't be shocked if he still ends up with 500 snaps next year. Probably, I would guess, more closer to 400, uh, which still, um, you know, hey, how long is Brandon Graham going to play, and how long is he going to play at a high level? We don't know. So maybe if he takes a step back, well, now Nolan Smith can come in, and again – one of the knocks on Nolan Smith is, is he kind of more of just a, a you know, can, can he be a complete edge rusher or does he mostly just do what he does? Well, uh, well, you don't need him to be a complete edge rusher. That's the beauty of this selection. This Eagles defensive line has as many stars on it as I've ever seen a defensive line have. Huge fan of this draft. I think that they absolutely killed it. Uh, yeah, those are my thoughts. What are yours? Let me know in the comments below. What do you think of them getting Nolan Smith Always love hearing from y'all, and of course, as always, thanks for watching.